I, all I have to do is kill anyone who saw me. That's all I gotta do. Welcome back, friends. Lost Guy here, and it's time for Hitman 3, Episode 2. So, best I can tell from Jinx talking about cannon kills, it's... It looks like a review she read was talking about how the kill we did feels canon. And it does feel like it's the canon way to do things. That's how it has been with these stories, where certain stories feel like they're the one that makes the most sense to the story. Where a Bird of Prey, you probably kill one guy, and in security, you kill the other guy. Which it felt the same way with two, like with the Washingtons. Like, some of those story kills felt like this is the more poetic way, this is the one that feels like it's the one that fits the story, while other ones were just hilarious. So, we'll go back and do these post-beating uh, the game. Let's go ahead and do Death in the Family. End of the line. But after we take out the partners, we got to take out the constant anyway. She came home. Carlisle's lost an empire. You fall hard enough, and you tend to be reminded of what truly matters. So, the end of the line. You ready for this? Are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? <laughs> I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Alexa Carlisle is dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlisle, wisely sensing that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlisle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlisle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlisle, is cold as ice, tough as nails, and sharp as a razor. Incidentally, it was her late father who first brought the three families together after the end of World War II at this very house. Huh. Meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. It began here, and it ends here. Talk about poetic. One more thing. According to our intel, Carlisle keeps a case file on the constant. Information that may be helpful in his recapture. So don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. See you on the other side. Alright. So we don't have all these cutscenes in the way, so I'm really curious about some things here. Take a look at the kind of kills we could do. So, she's the target. We also need to find that case file. Planning! Please tell me I can get the white suit. Well, these ain't all my suits. Where are the other suits? Casual. Classics. There they are. The white suit. Uh, this is a dumb suit. The signature old suit. The black suit. So the white suit. It's from Blood Money Ending. I assume that better be what that one is. Oh, actually, no, no. Wait, that's not. This is from, like, the pre-order or whatever. Where's the Blood Money suit? I don't see it. <laughs> Alright. That's funny. Alright. Lynch suit. Freedom Phantom suit. Wow. Alright, so let's just do what we're doing for this one. A gun! Coin, fiber wire, that's the way to go every time. Not challenges. These are five different things we can do. Alright. Let me hurt themselves. Target the assassinate with an accident, drowning, headshot, piano wire, uh, poison, so it's all normal. Redacted kill! Another death in the family. Someone else dies? Ooh. One for the ages. Electrocute her during the photo shoot? Ooh. Oh, you can drop them on her. Ooh. Great mistake. Put her to rest. That, I assume, is going to be like the cannon kind of feeling kill, right? Keep calm and aim. Eliminate her in her private room. Maybe it's that one. Depends on what the brother wants to do also. Can't be at the river bridge. Obtain a unicorn horn. Kill with the unicorn horn, I hope. 
See what else is special here. Private investigator? Alright. I'm also curious what Easter eggs are going to be in this game. Dog secret? Okay, that's redacted. You always want to find those redacted because you're just curious, right? I'll train the bulldog cane. Do you like dags? This is for a prize. This guy's up as a lawyer. Hunting. Tough gear. Bring out your dead. Undertaker! Yes! Who, wants, who doesn't want to be the Undertaker? It was two where you could be a scarecrow, wasn't it? I think it was two. And both Milton, Fitzpatrick, bank tokens. Tuppence. Find all clues in each location interest of in the There's a murder mystery? What? Please tell me that's one of the stories in these different feats. Whatever, okay, wait. Redacted. So these are just things we can do as achievements. Present the, present the grave for okay. Spy on her. So there's a lot of things we can do. Well, I find interesting there's a murder mystery. Elton would be proud. Oh, here's the stories. Okay, so that's enough looking at these. Wait, wait. So there's a bunch of Carlisle, Carlisles here. Matter of guilt. Oh, we can talk to her? Okay, that seems cool. Found a resting place. Yeah, that's the one where we can push into the grave. I feel like that would be hilarious. Don't kill the messenger. Matter of loyalty redacted. So this is just having a conversation. All right. I'm curious. All oh, the classics. Okay. Missions. Means, motive, and opportunity. A day to remember. Her final resting place. This one seems like the hilarious one to do. This one's the one that probably has the most conversation. So we'd probably want to do that if we can find it first. What we find is the one we do, I guess. Whoops, did that wrong. So let's get going. Thornbridge Manor. The Carlisle family's home for countless generations. The Revenant Alexa Carlisle and her three adult children, younger brother Zachary, grandson and daughter-in-law, are all gathered to conduct Carlisle's sham funeral. Curiously, Carlisle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now, the target knows that you're coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, gentlemen. The PI feels like immediately the thing to go for. Death in the family. Start more England. Instantly go for the PI. He's right there. You have to go for him. This is a private area, sir. Phineas Whitmer, private investigator. I have an appointment with Madame Carlisle. Please wait. Mr. Whitmer is here to see Madame Carlisle. You can go right in. That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator hired by Madame Carla this morning. I'm curious. What? Internet? Come on now. Guess why he's here. Maybe you should do some detecting yourself, 47. Right. A famous private investigator summoned by Alexa Carlisle has arrived at Thornbridge Manor. If you take his place, it may be an opportunity to get close to Madame Carlisle. Yes. I want to do the other one, but let's do this. We'll find the other ones in the future. This feels like the one where you talk to her the most, so it's gotta be the one you're supposed to do. Now trespassing. I gotta find a point I can grab him. Oh, what's this? Oh, sweet lady brick. All right. I gotta find a good point I can take him. Well, I gotta follow. It doesn't say just grab the guy yet. I see where I'm gonna go. Mr. Whitmer, thank God you're here. Can I take you to Madame Carlyle? Please do. If you'd follow me. How far do I have to go? I wouldn't say anything, but I'm so relieved you're here. Everything's just so strange. 
preparing for Madame's funeral, and then she turns up alive. But then the awful business with her brother Zachary, and, and all this security. I've never seen the place guarded like this, and, and, and I dare say I don't like it at all. Oh, this is balls. Not in a good position now. I need to do a suit oh, change. By the way, I told Kate about those texts. What did she say? Well, I thought she'd be mad at me, but she just thanked me. Said she understood the position I was in. Of, we had a really good talk about it. Actually. I ain't gonna be able to follow him now. Tell you. She's a sensible woman, and that stuff from your ex was like manipulation 101. I know, I know. I guess I thought she was gonna read into them and freak out, and say I must have done something to provoke her. Shit, man. Caroline really did a number on you. This is bad. I'm in a bad spot. Side window. I am extra trespassing now. How far am I going to follow this guy? Look at the mini map. There are people nearby. He's up there. Hope he doesn't notice me. Or I'm going to hide him, I guess. Wait, Lady Brick! Ah, let's go ahead and pee him now. Took me long enough. Dump the body. Alright! They've already searched him, so I don't have to worry about that. I hope I don't have to worry about that. If there's a place to dump my gun, I gotta find a place. Meet her in the foyer. No one suspects a thing. No one knows who I am, so Mr. that helps. Whitmer, thank you for coming on such short notice. A great tragedy has fallen upon us, and I need a quick resolution handled with absolute discretion. Results okay. and discretion are my speciality. Very well. I suppose you will want to start at the crime scene. In my experience, a thorough examination of a potential crime scene is half the job done. Good. Fernsby will take over from here. I am Mr. Fernsby, the butler. Madame Carlyle has asked me to assist you in any way possible. Mr. Whitmer, I understand that you've traveled from London. Would you care for some refreshments? Or do you prefer to go straight to Mr. Zachary's sleeping quarters? Oh my god, so I have to solve the mystery to get to talk with her. Let's go! I prefer to get started. As you wish. If you'll follow me, sir. I gotta solve this mystery to get her. All right. Well, this is gonna be a fun game. Let's go. I'd rather bury her in a grave. That seems way more hilariously. Oh, I feel obliged poetic. to point out that current affairs surrounding Madame Carlyle are of a delicate nature. You may be familiar with the recent announcement of her death. You will probably learn that a staged funeral is scheduled to take place tomorrow. Madam's children were not informed until this morning that their mother was in fact not dead at all. So please bear with them if they seem Hello, affected sir. by the rather unusual situation. Really I trust changed. I do not need to remind you that there will be consequences if word gets out that Madam Carlyle is still alive. I'll consider her dead when I leave. <laughs> Before you inspect the crime scene, I will tell you this. The case concerns the death of Mr. Zachary, Madame Carlyle's younger brother. He was found dead in his bed this morning. The door was locked from the inside, and a suicide letter was found in his room. However, Madame Carlyle suspects foul play and will not accept that he took his own life. I have prepared either? some information for you, so please do come and see me when you've finished your investigation of the crime scene. This is Mr. Zachary's room, to my right. In we go! All right. A locked room murder mystery, 47. I trust you'll get to the bottom of this. <laughs> First, let's not have the gun handy. Coins. Okay, so... This will be fun. Go clockwise. Book! A hidden door. Hmm. Do that now uh, later. Let's go check the other sides first. What do we got? We got ourselves a place that we can enter. 
We see nothing. All right, get out. Okay. I love how silly Hitman can be a little bit. Like, we're here to murder someone. Oh, hey, you need to uh, investigate this murder situation to play the part. Zachary's suicide note. Also, a sample of handwriting. Good point. Suicide note found in Zachary's ca uh, Carlisle. I don't even know how that spells that. Oh, Carl Isle. Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. He reads, I am haunted by horrible past choices and their consuming consequences. Alexa was the raft keeping me afloat. Without her, I cannot go on. Goodbye, signed Zachary. This was his her younger brother? It could be relevant to compare to other samples to establish its authenticity. Good point. With all these globes with the freaking alcohol in them. Investigate the laptop. We just know the password? Zachary was shopping for New Wellingtons last night. Not exactly what you would expect from someone suicidal. Yeah. Wellington boots. Why don't you use your camera to scan the dead body, 47? Ooh, they really like pushing for this new camera thing. Take a knife. Okay. Yeah. All right, well, he's hella dead. Uh, camera, huh? Throat markings indicate a rare, short-lived plant poison killed him. Poison ivy. Spread shows time of death at around 10 o'clock last night. You do know your poisons, 47. All right. But he was poisoned. Anything else over here to look at? So he was poisoned. So we know he was poisoned, just gotta figure out how. And I saw that in the challenge or whatever called poison ivy, so let's take a look in here now. Whoop. It's a secret passage. This could explain how the door was locked from the inside. Oh well, I'd hate to be hate to be looked on from over here. Ooh, floor plan, sweet. Hmm. A photocopy of the floor plans. Somebody's been researching the secret ins and outs of Thornbridge Manor. I believe you've done a thorough search of the crime scene, 47. Maybe it's time to see the butler. I'm curious about the information he's prepared for you. Let's go. Go talk to the butt. Where the hell is he? He's downstairs, so I gotta go downstairs. Can I trespass? That's some... Oh, that's the lawyer. Hm, mess with them in the future. Let's do this mission. Put my camera away. Hmm. Oh, blend in as a bodyguard. Okay. Great, I gotta find the stairs. Oh, the stairs the other way. Oops. We can drop that on her. I wonder when. Jesus, those antlers. That's a lot of antlers. You involved? Yeah, there's a third floor. Hello! Subdue. Mr. Fernsby, I'm done with the crime scene. Did you establish a time of death? Zachary died around 10 o'clock last night. Well, that means the staff were off duty. And Madame Carlyle and her security didn't arrive until this morning. Okay. That leaves Madame's family and myself as the only persons here when he died. And yeah. before you ask, no, I do not have an alibi. I was alone in my office at the time of death. Here is the material that I prepared for you. It's a list of the possible suspects and their quarters. Hopefully that will help you keep track of your findings. Please come and see me when you've solved the case, and I will take you to Madame Carlyle. you would be like, I've solved the case, and then just kill her in there alone. All right, let's, no act let's do this. This Intel. is very useful information, 47. Six people investigate. Gregory Carlyle, Edward Carlyle, Rebecca Carlyle, Emma Carlisle, Patrick Carlisle, and the Bootla. 
Clarified in front front that he was working in his office last night does not have an alibi. Whoever's got a chemistry set? Who's got the chemistry set? Son of Emma and Gregory? Okay. Son of the eldest, so he's the grandson. Alright. So how does one solve a murder mystery 47? Motive means an opportunity, I believe. Title drop! May I suggest you ask the suspects for alibis? Or perhaps you prefer searching the manor for clues first? Oh wow, we're really doing this. We're really doing this. This is awesome. Alright, let's go. Gotta search every room, I guess. Alright. Uh, do I know where each person's room is? Nope, just know who people are. So I guess we'll talk to people first and get the clues. How do I know what's the location of- oh, map. Map. Uh, wrong button. Okay, so second floor where we are. No, we're on the first floor. The so second floor has some places to discover. Let's see the first floor. This is the bathroom. That door leads to Emma and Gregory's room. Oh, that door. Okay. I was like, what? Now, the advantage to just being this dude is you get access to everywhere. There's, a, there's always that outfit that has access to everywhere. And this is that one. Gregory and Emma. Need a key. I have to break into this then. Oh, wait. Okay, let's see. So this is their room. Newspaper. Yeah, here we go. This is how we get in. Oh, this is ballsy. Okay, yeah, go. Go, go, go. Gotta find ourselves an open window. Oh, please have an open window. Oh, balcony. Here we go. You could not pay me to do this. Oh, God. Oh, man. Just one broken concentration. You're done. No one's in here, so... Alright, let's investigate. That's a letter opener. Oh, Emma's mother. Now, this is interesting, 47. A letter from Emma's mother stating that Emma is the illegitimate child of Alexa's late older brother, Montgomery. And listen to this. She claims to have witnessed Alexa and Zachary murder him. The plot thickens. Wait, wait, wait. That means Emma's like a cousin, right? Because Emma's married to the other guy. I can dump a propane flask of snap. Oh. Walking cane. There it is. Gimme. That's an achievement. Put it back down. What's this? Greenhouse cheap. A keychain right. pendant for the greenhouse. <gasps> oh. What's that doing in Emma and Gregory's room, I wonder? And why is the key missing? Oh, the plot thickens. I think that's everything in this room. Because we know the dude was poisoned, and why wouldn't she have thought to think that Zachary, who killed her father... So she married in... Oh, she married into this family just to kill... The people who killed her parents? Her father? Only guess I've got. This is a non-lethal weapon? That's a silly weapon. That's one room down. So I gotta talk to people. Okay, security? Oh, this is Gregory. No, no, this is security. <laughs> I push him right off. I keep going. Very well, Mr. Fernsby. Make sure you focus on your work. I will. I don't need one more maid crying in the kitchen. So watch yourself around young Mr. Patrick. Don't oh, worry about me. 
Okay, I see, I see. Mr. Patrick, can I do anything for you? Uh, yes, actually. Could you speed up time so I don't die from well, boredom? The grandson's a douche, I okay. I may not survive an entire weekend in this shithole. Perhaps a brisk walk in the garden would do you good. I said speed up time, not my time. I'll just go away with you. Of course, sir. I'll come back later. How very kind of you, dear Mr. Phonesby. I hope to see you soon. Creepy old git. Hey, buddy. Patrick Carlyle. Can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? Harassing oh, a lady? Shit, it's that sneaky butler, isn't it? He ratted me out. Elaine, give us some privacy, would you? The lady Don't who doesn't have a broom? Okay. She's really tense these days, and the last thing I need is more hassle. I took that pretty blonde, um, Rosie, uh, for an evening stroll. I, I mean, how the fuck am I expected to cope for an entire weekend in this shithole? I'm bored out of my mind. If that's all, I think I'll get back to my slow death by boredom. What did you think of Zachary? Oh, creepy as hell. No ambition. Imagine deciding to live in a museum. You know, father says Zachary and Alexi used to be two of a kind. He had a great future ahead of him. Then suddenly, he just gave up everything. What an idiot. Thank God daddy chose looks and brains over pedigree when he married mummy. I don't have to worry about the inbreedings her customary in these circles. So, and yet he is, is that it? And yes, he is. Did and yet he is. Did you see anything suspicious last night? He was in bed. No. I reckon Zachary topped himself. I know I would have. Or perhaps Mr. Fernsby. I don't like him. He could have done it. All right. Poker. All right. So that's one down. I'm gonna go back up there. Do, 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 do. So our reason is Emma married Gregory, who is her cousin. So she can get revenge. The lawyer in the, the small office. Did you check his travel documents? I did, sir. Did you check it out? About the lawyer. Over here. This investigation can be a bit. Nothing. Okay. Okay, so I went up that here. That is the door to no, Rebecca's room. This is Rebecca. All right, so we got to sneak into here next. No one's in the room, so out we go. Did we almost have vault as an option? Jesus. So we've been to Emma and Gregory's room. We're about to go to Rebecca's room. What will be missing is what Patrick's room, Burnsby's room, and there's another person I forgot already. What do we got? Investigate. Rebecca's the daughter, right? I can see from the log that Rebecca was in a conference call from 9 p.m. to midnight last night. Alibi? It was not Rebecca. Painting. Was this the other side of the, the hidden room? Oh no, it's not. This is a different secret room. All right. I need to get a listing of asset transfers from the Carlisle account HTC Depot number five zero eight five. No, I need it immediately. Yes, I'll hold. This is just another way in here. All right. Well, I don't need to be in here, do I? Yes, this I'm still person? here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, yeah, this, yeah, this. <laughs> yeah, we don't need to be in there. Okay. So we have her alibi, so she's good. Which one will we not do? Only knew what we face. I wonder what you would do. Attack? Regroup? Close the gates and wait it out? I'll talk to her father. I've got a couple rooms down. Where am I going here? It's a big place. Going. 
Oh, it's a missing switch. Forget it. It's not a coin. Looking good. Looking good. Yep. What about this room? What about this room? Oh, Zachary. I see. At least you never got to learn that the horrible thing we did was for nothing. To protect the Carlyle legacy, what bollocks. Oh, when they killed the brother. It's all gone, I fear. That bloody Arthur Edwards, how did I not see it? <laughs> I doubt our big brother could have botched it up any worse than I have, even if he tried. I don't remember who Edwards is. I do not remember who Edwards is. I have to look that up. Will this freak them out? It does not. Okay. So I need this guy to get out of my dang way. But I can take him and then just kill her if I want. Because I need to see where this goes. I didn't do that. Just leads out here. Oh, that's the missing switch. Okay, whoa, what was this? Okay, we gotta we gotta speed this up. How are we going? Oh yeah, we gotta speed this up, okay. So run more. Obviously the greenhouse is where the answer is, but we should investigate thoroughly in case we're wrong. I've been here. Is there a room in the middle, or is that just stairs? Probably just stairs. Okay, so we've been there. We've been all over this floor. We gotta go up a floor. And up. So, how do I do? Okay, check the map. How do I go up? Those are both downs. We saw the up. Where is it? Over here? Yeah, the up's over here. Here we go. Clock. We seem to be allowed up there. Okay. Frankly, I don't give a shit. I'm not letting you through here. We're not allowed up there. Okay, okay. All right, now I know. Now I know. Okay, so we gotta go down. Sorry, man. Just punch it in the face in front of everyone. Like, oh shit. So the rest of the rooms are down below. Here we go. Armed with my feather duster. So let's check out all these rooms. This is where we took the guy out. This is the staff room. Probably not a sword? Wow, straight up saber. That is the door to Mr. Fernsby's office. Is there a way in? I don't see a way in. I still don't know there's no way into this room. You would need ferns to open up for you. So upset, Why not? She's never seen a dead body before. Life can be tough sometimes. Alexa, back from the dead. A make-believe funeral. A murder mystery. Oh, it's all too much. Don't worry. I'm sure everything will settle down soon. Oh. Mm, don't if they if I grab it in front of them, they'll be like, "What the hell?" Can't grab it in front of them. Go back in. Too busy for my taste. Tell me. She turned up and demanded to be put up in Madame Carlyle's bedroom. We're the new heads of the family after all. It is only fitting, she said. Well, Gregory put a stop to that, which was a surprise. He normally accepts his wife's outrageous behavior without batting an eyelid. But staying in his mother's bed so soon was just a bit steep, I suppose. She can't wait to get her hands on Thornbridge Manor. But he was such a gentleman. He gave me his coat and all. Rosie, you need to forget about Patrick. Oh, that's no Rosie. Good's gonna come of it. Stick to your own kind. You mean oh. like Chris? He treated me like shit. Okay, so can I break in now? I got a crowbar. Oh, it is gonna make some noise. Hmm. Huh? All right, didn't make that much noise. All right, trespassing. What we got? Get the master key. That'll help me out. The burnt diary. Zachary's diary. Oh. This is big. He was about to confess to the world 
that he and Alexa murdered their older brother, Montgomery, 46 years ago. And apparently, Mr. Fernsby helped make the murder look like an accident. And 47, the handwriting doesn't match the suicide letter in his room, proving he didn't write it himself. Ooh! Ooh! We're gonna tell her what happened and she's like, well, I'm gonna have to have you killed now. Interesting. Question is who did the kill then? Oh, poison pill drug! Painkillers. Lethal if you use enough of them. But not the poison used to kill Zachary. Of course, Madame Carlyle doesn't know that. Are you considering to frame the butler, 47? Mr. Fernsby clearly didn't commit the murder, but I think you have enough evidence to convince Madame Carlyle he did. Maybe you should tell him you are ready to present your findings. Unless, of course, you want to do some more detecting, 47? You want to be a real detective? You never get to be that. You're usually the one doing the killing. On it. Oh, ho, ho, ho. hello. Break that and use that weapon. Quite Let's do this for real. We've been, we've been right. playing this long. Let's commit. Beautiful. Let's commit to solving the case. We we'll solve the case. Eventually. Yeah, it went that way already. That's the staff room. That's weird. Oh, this is the dining room. You can apparently listen to that guy play piano. Apparently, I just missed that achievement. Huh, a bust. I can bust someone with this bust. Yes, hi, Cassie. It's me again, Edward. Talk to him later, apparently. I know I'm not supposed to leave you messages, and this is the last time, I promise. It's just, uh,. I don't know how to handle this whole situation. I don't think I can really. I, I, I can't feel my legs, and my eyes are not working. That guy stressed the hell out. Flicker thing again. You can't tell anyone. The, the thing is, I've been asked to perform the eulogy at the funeral event. Oh. That's a shocking. Yeah, okay. The family photo here. You, she dies from shock. <laughs> this is where you do it. All right. There's the greenhouse. I guess I'm gonna do the investigation. Let's go do that. I know, that's where it is. Forget what I said. Got to be kidding me. No power, no portrait. Oh, Madame Carlyle will be furious. Uh, she expects the family photo to be done any moment now. I need this shoot to happen, okay? And I need it to be perfect. Can't, can't we just take a fuse from another fuse box? Uh, I, I guess we could do that. Good. I'll finish setting up, and then we'll grab the fuse just before you call down the family. That's another kill right there. Yeah. That's a good plan. He'll hurt the family photo. That is hilarious. To the greenhouse. Am I even allowed in here? Oh, I don't have the key. Well, then. Uh, look around first. What we got? Water we can poison. We do have the ability to poison. We'd only just run through his plan for the spring seedlings yesterday. Yes, sure. But he he was upset believing his sister was dead. I'd say worried about how things would be handled with Gregory and Emma taking over. I said they let him stay here, but Ethel was sure Emma would throw him out first chance she got. Now we'll never know. Oh my. You're taking this hard. Aren't and you? Emma killed him. Hmm. Gotta do it the old-fashioned way. Oh shit! Oh shit! Okay, that's a problem. Run! Ah, I'm getting shot at! No, 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 no! Yeah, that's what I get for breaking in. All right. Well, this is a problem because I'm still doing an investigation. Shit! 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 All right. Hi. All I have to do is kill anyone who saw me. That's all I gotta do. Two guys! Alright. Gun. That's how I aim. Okay. Gotta kill these guys. That's all I gotta do. No one else suspects a thing. No one else suspects a thing. 
freaking break, break. in. Garden is clear. Delta November out. Hey, don't look at the bushes too closely. Okay, three guys I have to kill. You can come out now. We won't shoot you. I have to kill. We're nope. Shoot him, right? <laughs> We're allowed to shoot him, right? I have to kill three dudes. Three dudes. All right. Standing down. Target is around here somewhere. I thought it was far enough. I thought I was far enough away that no one would hear it. Uh. Oh, damn. that's a lot of people I have to kill. A lot of oranges. I might be able to just sneak in, actually. Okay, wait for it. Yeah, we're definitely not getting the Sound of Sounds achievement now. I might be fine. Just need to not be noticed by certain people. By certain four people. So obviously, those three are a problem. I'm compromised, but not by everyone. Only by certain individuals am I compromised. Like this guy. Compromised by this guy. Ugh. This will get everyone's attention over here. There we go. Who heard the gunshot? Pick that back up! Okay. Alright, well, no one's going here, so I'm good. Rare plants. Okay, here's another person who saw. Oh, someone found the body. Uh, let's continue our investigation. Broken lab equipment. Rare plants. It looks like it was recently used, though. Wrench! Ah! Poisonous. Okay, I need to search bodies real quick to do this investigation, apparently. Because now I need a wrench! Where is there a wrench? At least there's a wrench here. It's a boat key. Alright, that doesn't help me out. Hey, can you hear me? We got this guy's body. Alright, well that's just great. That's just great! I need a wrench! At least tell me that's a wrench. The crowbar isn't. That better be a wrench. Thank God! Alright, let's go. Woo! Woo! Hide, 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 hide. Certain people would notice. Hide. Oh, some of the people who saw me. Oh shoot! Okay, I gotta go hide again. Ah, uh, that just made things way more complicated for myself. Crap to me! Alright, okay. Okay, okay. Hiding. Hiding. I need to kill that guy anyway. Pull out my gun! Alright. Hey, I'm hiding. I should be good. Someone's misbehaving. Oh, it's because I was hiding. I was... Oh, jeez. This guy almost got me. What do you mean, find the case file? What do you mean, he has the case file? What? What was that about? Was that a bug? Well, the game just told me to kill this guy. That's all I know. Well, there. Oh, who heard it? That's a gun. That's a guy. Drag the body. Don't be seen. Yeah. Okay, maybe everyone who can compromise me is good, so I can just walk in now. It said he had the case file, that's all I know, Jesus. 
Okay, I got a wrench. Time to fix it. Fix. Produce poison. Lethal poison. Poison ivy. I think we have enough information. We just made a poison. Question is who broke it? Do I have enough poison to just kill everyone in this place? I think everyone who's a problem, like, and I'm past besides this person, so I just gotta run. I was compromised. Annually plugged in fuses? Do they even exist anymore? How old is this shit? Well, I know where the fuses are. Okay. So... I need to have some way to prove Emma was the one who did it now, so I gotta find and talk to Emma. I'm compromised by some people. Did you find out if the vote was notarized? Here we go. But how the hell did that happen? Nope. We all signed it. He's not the I gave it to him in person. He's not the one, but he says he got it notarized the very same day. Right, listen. You go to their office and ask the sheriff. That's just a security guy, or you want to see the record. Don't take no for an answer. Butterflies. As soon as you've got them. Alright, you better see it quickly. Thanks, we'll get to the bottom of this. The what? The Maori puddle? Hey man. Rebecca Carlisle. Can you tell me about yesterday evening? We already we heard really see much of each other, my brothers and I. I suppose it takes our mother's funeral to bring us together, and even then it's not like we sit on each other's laps. Now, let's see. Patrick, Gregory's son, disappeared straight after dinner. You know. I think he might be in some sort of trouble. Edward wanted to go as well, but Gregory convinced him to stay for a few drinks before they went off for a pint at the local at a quarter to nine. I swear Gregory enjoys Edward's discomfort over staying here. I had a conference call with my New York office at nine, so I spent three hours on my laptop in my room and yep. went straight to bed afterwards. I don't know about Emma. She did act a bit strange. You know, I bet she was making lists for changes needing to be done once she gets her hands on Thornbridge Manor. Quite the shock she had when Mother arrived during breakfast. Is that everything, hmm. Mr. Whitmer? Zachary. Tell me about Zachary. Did he act strange last night? You know, now you mention it, he was a lot more chatty than usual. He wanted to know about my connections in the publishing business. Oh! Apparently, a friend of his is writing a book. Which strikes me as very peculiar. I didn't think he had any friends. Is there anything else you... Anything else you feel like mentioning? I may be wrong, but I saw Mr. Fernsby, the butler, leave Zachary's room early this afternoon. And he seemed a bit startled when he saw me in the hallway. It's probably nothing. Oh, and one more thing. Please be kind to Edward. He can only take so much. Is that everything, Mr. Whitmer? You yeah. have a lot to see to. Okay. Talking to Madame Carlyle's daughter. Rebecca? Yes. Oh, 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 oh. She's insistent, that one. She kept asking all kinds of questions. Who had the other one? Why well, I gave it to her, that sort of thing. You did make sure she didn't see you give the other one to the butler. Oh, the coins. Of course. It was just about the coins. Which, we don't know if we need those coins, but we might. The butler's got one coin and someone's gonna... The hearse! Ooh. Oh, use the hearse as an exit. Give me that. Yeah, yeah. Freaking gun right there. Oh, this is a toilet. Okay. Go back in. We still have, what, Edward's room to check? And that's... And Patrick's room, I guess? Like it keeps telling me I'm compromised. I've already been to this guy. Where's the okay, what rooms have I missed? Front door. I feel like I've been everywhere, but I haven't been everywhere. Oh, we haven't been here. 
And then Gregory. Get any kind of explanation. It's bloody rude. That's what it is. Making us come here to play funeral and then show up like nothing's the least bit strange. Back down, Don't get your knickers all twisted. I'm telling you, she's not fit to be in charge. You're the hair yeah, she's pushing for the house. Stand. You and me both. Here we go. Everyone's busy. Well, I get a gym for sitting here and listening. And he's not done. You know, Monster Hunter makes me appreciate when they do things special. It would be very interesting to see how I was doing the keys correctly. Professor Edward Carlyle, can you tell me your whereabouts for last night? Oh, yes, this dreadful business with Zachary. That's why, okay. I stay at the local inn. You see, I prefer not to spend the night here at Thornbridge Manor. My brother Gregory came along for a nightcap. He'll never admit it, but I think he understands that I find this whole thing upsetting and wanted to provide some comfort. I believe we went to the stag's head around half past eight. If that's all, I have a speech to write. Can you tell me about Zachary's behavior last night? I certainly didn't expect him to commit suicide. Sure, he was upset by a mother's supposed death. We were. But he seemed more engaged than usual. You should ask Rebecca, they had a long talk. Did you know that he hadn't left Thornbridge Manor in nearly 50 years? His plants, Ooh. mother, and the staff were all the company he had. Anything else I can do to help? Did you notice anything else out of the ordinary? You mean apart from the fact that we came here to bury our mother and she shows up alive and kicking? Zachary found dead in his bed this morning? Or perhaps that the planned funeral is still taking place and I have to do the eulogy? And mother will surely have strong opinion on it afterwards. I can't breathe. Excuse me. <laughs> He's a professor, isn't he? Alright. Let's go back to these two. And then I'll solve the case! So the, oh, where the hell'd she go? Oh, she's over there, okay. Talk to him. Gregory Carlyle, can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? Oh, you're wondering about my alibi, Mr. Detective. Well, um, I left Thornbridge around half eight for a pint with Edward. I wish I hadn't. <laughs> Quiz night at the inn. On the other hand, staying here with Zachary, my obnoxious sister, and the wife sporting another one of her headaches would have been a fate worse than death. <laughs> the, the short of it, Zachary was very much alive when we left. I stayed for the last shout, and I was back here just before midnight. Anything else you want to pry from my intricate intellect? Tell me about Zachary. Zach? Huh. Such a sad old sod. A bit heavy on the bottle. But who could blame him? The only company he had was his rare plants and mother, who travels more than she stays here. Honestly, I can't say which is the bigger ball. He's better off dead. Is that all? Not very thorough, are you? Anything else you'd like to tell me? Nothing, really. I'm just enjoying the show. Our perfect mother obviously fucked up, didn't she? Faking her own death. You know, she's explained nothing to us. I think she's scared to own up to her own mistake. I'm gonna assume just incest happened here. A lot of, lot of incest happening in this family. Hello. Emma Carlisle. Almost more Can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? Surely I'm not a suspect. I need to account for everyone. Well, I spent the evening with my family, but I got an awful migraine and had to take to bed. Everyone can attest to that. I believe I went up when the boys sat down for a drink around eight o'clock. Is that all? How did you feel about Zachary? I might as well be honest. His presence was always awkward. But how do you have a meaningful conversation with a man who only cares about plants? In my opinion, Alexa bears some responsibility for how this ended. She supported his self-limiting behavior by letting him live here. Anything else you want to know? Have you noticed anything else out of the ordinary? Nothing special comes to mind. Except, perhaps, I did get a feeling that Zachary was depressed, not just sad. I suppose he realized that he had no one with Alexa gone. 
Even Alexa must feel the pangs of guilt over that one, letting him believe she was dead. Then again, guilt isn't her strong suit. Wait, what have we not done? We've done everything, haven't we? Question, question, alibi confirmed. Alibi confirmed, alibi confirmed. I have to confirm alibis? How do I prove her guilt? Because we know it's her. Can I talk to everyone else again? I can't. How do I prove her guilt? Oh god, we've been at this for a while. Oh, okay. Well, I missed that conversation. Uh... He was in this room. Oh, this, these guys. Okay. I still gotta find the case file after this. Playing detective. Pick up the little ball, hit him with it. So, how long have you been working here? About a month now. Oh, he's going for it. Um, hmm. I don't know what I can do. Go back up to the rooms, maybe? Why is the changing room? Coming along inside. Is everything ready for tomorrow? Okay, a headache from all the decisions. Oh, oh talk to her, right. About Patrick. Rosie, tell me what you did last night. I'm in trouble, aren't I? I... I spent the evening with Patrick. We met after dinner and I went home at one in the morning. He said he needed someone real to talk to. When he looks at you, it makes you feel like the center of the universe. Get those sunglasses like a on? princess. But now he just ignores her. Well, he, he's under a lot of pressure. He's oh, an no. idiot. That's what he is. Huh. Did you notice anything out of the ordinary? Any strangers outside the house? No, no, we saw no one outside. I except Patrick's mother, Emma. We were sitting on the bench behind the greenhouse talking when she came out and um, we had to hide. You won't tell her about me and Patrick, will you? She'd insist Madame Carlyle fire me. I'm sure of it. Too right she will. She's always going on about how things will change once she's in charge of Thornbridge Manor. Is that, is that it? Is that it? Okay, so alibi confirmed. All that's left is... Emma! But we already went to the greenhouse! Oh no, I have to, but Amy thinks she might be pregnant. I'm gonna be a dad. You'll be fine, Robert. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. So I gotta do, I gotta recheck all the Emma stuff real quick. So first things first. Yeah, wrong way. Where the balls is Emma? Wish I could tag places. So Emma's in the main back. Oh, Fernsby. No, no, no. I talked to him when I want to finish this. I can't do anything else with Fernsby. Well, obviously he knows nothing about his wife. No, can't. Okay. I gotta go back to the greenhouse! I already did that, right? Like, what is there to do with the greenhouse? Unless there's something I missed. Now, yeah. If I could just think of something interesting to say during the shoot to grab Rebecca's attention. I had plans to offer her comfort, but now that Madame Carlyle isn't dead after all, okay. uh, I know we're not supposed to talk about Go over here. Anything I missed out here? As far as I can tell, I went to the greenhouse. I broke into the greenhouse. Is this was ask like a groundskeeper? Too late for that. Did I screw this up? Can't help but wonder if I screw this up. So, so back to the second floor. Rebecca, then again. Can't question anyone anymore. Get and talk to Patrick. So, second floor again. Check the room again. See if there's anything I miss in the room. As far as I know, I did everything here. I found that greenhouse tag. It was over here on this stuff. I found the greenhouse tag. I never found the greenhouse key. She might have the greenhouse key. Take the letter opener just because. That shiny's in here. We took that letter. 
Oh, what about out here? Nothing out here. What the hell? Oh, that's a pipe. I can climb. If there's anything else I need, I don't know where to find it. In there. Burn his cave. I've done all I can. I got no idea what else I can do. Oh, he noticed us. Uh, they noticed him noticing them. The brick. Ugh. All right. Okay. Okay. So I think we've done everything we can. Wait. Over here. Another letter opener. We've done all that we can. We've questioned. We don't have her as a viable suspect, which I don't understand. Off of migraine, company was always awkward. He was always consuming kind of pants. That she has seen nothing out of the ordinary. Said that Zachary appeared to be depressed after a parent loss. I guess check Zachary's room one more time. And then we'll have done everything. I don't know. Uh, I wanted to solve the case, Holmes. Wanted to solve the case. I failed to solve the case. This is Rebecca's room. Exactly. She holds the other one. All the coins. I want her to have the file on Arthur Edwards if I die. All the file. She fools, she will be in trouble if she knows. She will start digging when she realizes things don't add up. Yeah, keep it real. Inevitably getting her in trouble. I'd rather she knew who she's up against. She's clever and resourceful. Oh, Rebecca's a trusted one. She'll be able to hit him where it hurts. Oh, the butler but has a coin. I don't want her to get involved prematurely. Okay. Hopefully she'll never have to get involved at all. We're learning about the coin. So the butler has one for Rebecca and she's got the other. Check again. Why is no way I got everything in this room? As far as I know, I've done everything I can. I've done everything I can. Include investigation. Guess I'll go talk to Fernsby. Yeah, the switch is missing. Can I investigate that? Where would that switch be is a good question. Who knows where that is? You can't find him in Eva's room. Unless... Don't say more to that weird detective than you need to. I was just having a laugh, dear. There we go. Dear. Must admit, he's pretty good. What if he believes we had something to do with Zachary's death? Oh, please. He's circling us. I don't see him snooping around your sister. I bet Alexa said something. There you go, okay. Go back over here. Can I just take that cane? That cane the switch? Ah, balls. I put it too far. Mistake was made. Oh. There, I can get the I can get the cane. No, I can't. No, I can't. I screwed up. I screwed up. Got it. Now, why is there a problem with me having this cane? Guys, look at the cane. And look at the cane. I lost connection again? Can retry connect. What's with the internet? I know a bajillion people are playing. Oh, we've gone over an hour. Oh my god, okay. Holy crap. Non lethal. Will anyone be mad about me holding this? Let's see. I want to see if this goes to that switch.
I have no idea what else I can do with this thing. Yeah! There you go. Figured that out. The cane was used for that. You need the cane to do the switch? Let's see here. Drop it. I never. Why is it red when I have this? Alright, well. I got nothing left. Let's go see Emma. One last time. How do I, where's the stairs? Here are the stairs. I gotta make sure no one has a circle over their head when they see me with this cane. Did Gregory freak out if he saw me with this cane? That's what I'm wondering. Where's Fernsby? Oh, no circles, okay. I can't... Uh, Alright, well, whatever it is to solve this case, I have failed. So let's just go see what's his name and say... We're done! Hey, Actually, map! There's a place of interest I haven't seen upstairs. What? Go back up, go back up, go back up, go back up. There's something I didn't see upstairs. What? What is it? Something I'm missing. It's gotta be the last place of interest. The last place I can access. Right there. Go here. Left. 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 Let. Le oh! Mysterious switch! The cane! Do it! What do we have in here? Coins. Classic coins. I got these coins. I can peep. Alright, so that's the achievement for Miss uh, Carlisle. Montgomery's long lost letter. An old letter, 47. Never opened. Must have slid under the secret door nearly 46 years ago. It states that Alexa Carlyle's older brother, Montgomery, wanted Alexa to become the heir to the Carlyle Empire instead of himself. Hmm. Interesting. You're an excellent detective, 47. Uncovering truths half a century old. If you frame it correctly, I believe you could use the information to convince Madame Carlyle that Zachary committed suicide. Maybe you should ask Mr. Fernsby to see her. Or perhaps you feel like digging a bit more. There's more! There's more to the case! There's more to the case! Okay, oh come on, okay. We're committed to this one, we gotta get this case done. We're gonna solve this case. I still don't know how to get Emma. But we don't have all the places seen. Alright, so, back down. Or back up. Hmm, go down, go down, go down. There's no way Emma was up there, right? Or maybe Emma was. I gotta find a way up there. Go, go, go back up, go back up. Gotta find a way up there. We don't know who's up there. Oh my god, that guy's trying. They just keep trying to talk, but I keep getting in the way. Is there a thing I can use to climb up? Not here. Gotta be a way to climb up. See a window there. There! Pipe! Okay, that's where I need to go. Gotta get up to the oh, third floor. Okay, that's a problem. God's sake. Sarge, 
Why, does he see me? I don't, okay, he saw me for a second. I was a little suspicious there. Oh, he didn't fully notice me. Okay, going up. Other way. Other way. Nobody looks up. No one ever looks up, right? As long as no one ever looks up. Bolt. Ooh, there's people here. Gotta make sure I don't get caught. Woo! Gotta make sure I don't get caught. This is not the best spot for me to be right now. <laughs> Wait, is there no... Oh, jeez. This is a bad thing I'm doing right now, isn't it? I gotta wait. I gotta be patient. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is not the spot I should have been. <laughs> Why did I come up here? Is that a button? Oh, I don't have the cane anymore! Ooh, that's bad! Oh, that's bad! This is not a good place for me to be. Even if I do the radio, I'll get that guy. Oh, I can hide him. Wait, okay, okay, I can do this. 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 Oh, it's gonna get the maid's attention. Ugh. Well, this investigation is taking a bit. I'm sorry, ma'am. I use a newspaper on you. Ooh, that was a hit. Like, I see this button, but I can't push without the cane. There's no way I can come up here without... Okay. Well, anyway, radio. I need a coin, I need a coin. That was close. Oh, here he comes. Oh, this is bad timing. This is bad timing. Depends on where that lady looks. He got the coin, not the radio! Ah! Alright, the radio's a waste of time. Alright, screw the radio. Alright, well, coin. Okay, looks like no one will notice what I'm about to do. Coin! What? I... Wrench, that'll be good. Something ain't right down here. I need people not to notice. You know what I'm looking for is probably not up here. I should probably go down. Go back down. Shit. Grab and run. No, Damn it! Ah, oh, no! Alright, fudge it. Let's go kill the lady. Where's my gun? Yes, yes. Hi. Yes, yeah, where is she? Hey, ma'am! I got her. Sir! 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 Ah! Shit! 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 Shit, 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 shit. Getting shot at. Getting shot at. Oh, no. Ah, I tried. I tried so hard. Stop shooting at me! Not nice. Is this really it? I'm, I'm not gonna. Fit for my life if that's I'm not gonna. Guy, shut up! I'm not going for you. Okay. Ugh. All right. Well. Echo 
All right. Oh, he's getting shot. Ow. 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 Yeah, I'm in her office. It's not the target place. Um. Yeah, he did. He lost visual. Ah, oh, bad time to run out of bullets. All right, let's see here. Catch! Whoop! There we go. All right. I kill all the guards yet? I'm so disappointed I screwed up this mission. An hour of investigation! An hour of investigation! And we failed the mission. Okay, well... Alright, who else do I need to kill? Oh, right, she had a coin, right? Where's her coin at? Okay, I need to get the other coin. All right. Okay. Maybe no one suspects a thing right now. Everyone's dead. No one knows. Huh? No one knows. Oh, that's good. That's good. All right. I gotta get the butler. I gotta conclude the investigation. I'm ready to present my conclusion to Madame Carlyle. Very well. If you'll follow me, sir. Oh no. Yeah, yeah. This way. Okay. Help. Let us go. Yeah. Okay. Are you? Oh. oh no! Yeah, an hour-long oh. investigation, then I John Wicked everything. Yeah. So I'm about to do another episode where I do this investigation correctly. That awful guy. He's in the corridor. You get up now. Oh Jesus! No, no! Don't tell anyone. Hold on, hold on. I, I, I think I. Hold on, hold on. Sir, 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 sir! Oh. Stop it! Are you out of your mind? Why would you be doing that? I'm sorry. I wanted to knock you out without a weapon, but now I'm going to have to use a weapon. Get back here, Frisbee! Frisbee! Bitch, get back here! There we go. Close the door. Alright, let's see. Where's the token at? There's the key. There's the token. That's what I needed. I got both coins, I think. So now i got to find this thing. While they're busy down there... I have an apple. Okay, so where the hell's the thing I'm looking for? Nope. Ah, here we go. Okay, get out of it. Oh, is that her coin? Got a panic button. But ah, okay, there we go. Peculiar icons above the safe. Oh shit. I wonder if they might be some sort of a code. Maybe have a look around the office, forty-seven. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. All right, okay. So there is a clock. Clock. Clock, 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 oh, clock. The clock is set to... Three? What the hell is that? The minute hand's up top. What's the hour hand doing? Oh, whatever. So maybe that's the minute hand? No, that wouldn't be the minute hand. Four. She's good with four. She's good with four on the clock there. No, no, no. Uh, do that again. Four. So now I need to get the... thing that you use to look at the sky. <laughs> this is where we would sit down and give her the answer, but I can't do that now. What's that thing called when you look at stars? Or astronomy? An astronomer dealy? Oh, hey! Private room. Smother her in here, probably. Hostile area, you say. Uh, telescope, that's the word, telescope. There's a telescope somewhere? There's an eagle right here. I can pick up an HX-10, what? Oh, I see. Woo, we really blew this one. Okay, here we go. Be a number on it, maybe? Open? Open, 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 what? Oh, open. oh, nine. There's a nine there. Oh, okay, there's a nine there. Okay. That poor butler took it pretty hard. Is there a number next to this clock? Get the phone. 
Uh, get the camera. Not the phone, get the camera. Okay. That wrong button. Uh, I meant to zoom out. Oh, there's a one. All right, one, nine. I somehow didn't see that a minute ago. Who puts their things like this in their house, really? On the case you forgot? Wait. One, nine, fireplace. Fireplace, 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 fireplace. Seven. All right. Who does this? Seven. And... The moose head? Oh, and Fabergé egg. Mine. Thank you. Pick up a bust. Also mine. Oh, here? Let's... Hmm. Camera, camera. I can't see the hell is there. I don't see a number on it. Is there another head somewhere? No, that's not a head. Over here. We're looking for like a moose head, right? I don't see a moose head anywhere. I see a bunch of freaking deer. They hunted a lot of deer. A deer head or a moose head? It's a moose head, so we gotta find a moose head. Be a lot of antlers. She killed a lot of things. Looking for a moose head. There? there? That's a moose. Alright, so where's the number? Five. Alright, there it is. Number five. Okay. Got it! All right. Mission complete. Well done, 47. Oh, no. He's breaking up. Oh, that's bad. Shit. All right, well, this just happened. Yeah, let's, let's waste the Fabergé egg. What completely irresponsible person would leave a weapon lying around? Good question. Catch! Oh shit, there's more people! Shit, 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 shit. Okay, that's not good. Catch! There we go. Alright, let's see here. Will this really work? Sir, sir, back the hell up. <laughs> You're kidding me! That worked, alright. You know what? Oh god, there's another guy with a gun. Alright. Shit, 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 hide. Over there! Dang it. There. You pull the strap on me, you're gonna get shot! Where is he? I, need help. I don't see him anymore! Move to better position! Shoot. Two! Woo, got him both. Alright. Who else? That's a butler. Stop! Stop that! Stop that! Stop! Stop! Ah, oh, 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 dang it. God, How's he gonna tell everyone about me? Man, the investigator really he killed a lot of people. Right Shit! There. Sir, 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 stop. I'm hit. Ah, shit, shit, shit. Damn, yeah, shit. Am I compromised? No, no, I'm not compromised. That's good. Shit, no, I'm compromised. I'm compromised. I'm compromised. Oh, she. Yeah. Compromised. Compromised. I need another oh, outfit. Where's Fernsby's outfit? I need that guy's outfit. Oh, she's dead. Uh, anyone got an outfit? Nope, already in that. Okay. Oh, was this? Messages? Right. Hello, this is Cassandra Cox, Edward's ex-wife. I don't know what's going on at your house. Read me. Edward, in command. There's some nutcase bash. Oh, yeah, he's leaving messages, right? Uh, butler, there he is. You cannot disguise yourself as the butler. Makes sense to me. They know who the butler is. And... Oh, well. Sucks to be him. Sucks to be him. Jeez, I need to get out of this game already. This is a very, very long run of this episode. Uh, from pro to not so pro. Anyone else? Anyone? Okay. Anyone else? 
I'm not killing all these people on purpose. It just keeps happening. What was that? What was that? Reporting a possible crime scene. Shut up! Alright. I'm killing way too many people. I don't have to kill. Hey, can you hear me? Are you okay? He's not okay. Alright. Now before I leave this place. Before I leave this place, we gotta kill the real killer. At least I'll feel better about myself. If I kill the real kill. There she is, there she is, there she is, there she is. Just need the room. Got her! There we go. Oh, no one saw that. Okay, I got her. Okay, let's get out of here. Where's the downstairs? Here it is, here's the downstairs. No one suspects a thing. Now hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey pal! Donk! Oh, that was hilarious. Ma'am, I need you to not do anything. Yeah, I know, I know. So let me knock you out with this. There we go. Alright. Okay! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, uh, no one saw. Okay. Security breach. I need you to move now. Go, 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 go. Okay. Go, go, go. Where's my outfit? Oh, here's my outfit. These suits are expensive. Put my suit back on. I am now trespassing. Okay, getting the hell out of here. In the corridor, there's nothing here. The hell is that? A baseball, I'll take that. Okay, where's that? I want that boat exit. I took the boat key for a reason. I'm gonna do the boat exit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. You know, I should probably just get out of here. Yeah, I should, I should just get out of here. Shit, 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 shit. Having a hard time just getting out of here. There's people everywhere. Alright. Okay, um... Too many things. Oh, pick that back up. Oh, reload. Okay. Screw it, I'll use the boat key another time. Use the boat key another time, just get out of here. Haha, <laughs> get out of there. Drop down, drop down, drop down. Run, run, run. Get to my bike. Get to my bike. Can I just go across the water? No, I can't. How did I get across the first time? I did not take the bridge. Oh, body found, you say? Body's found? Which one? I'm out of here. Why is it? Oh no! So while I was busy just effing around trying to do an investigation, the constant did things. Oops. Oh god. Oh my god. 90 minutes of mayhem for that. <laughs> Master of the household completed. Oh my god. We didn't solve the case. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. We were close though. We were close to solving the case. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, just bike out. 80 minutes. 80 minutes of failure. I just I just wanted to solve the case, dang it. What was I missing in that case? Unless I could have solved it at that point. I don't know what I was missing. Obviously the third floor wasn't the answer. I don't know what was the answer, but I blew it. You owe him nothing. Let's see what happens now. Forty-seven. Don't respond, just listen. Diana can't help you now. 
You need to find Olivia. She will know what to do. I wish there had been more time. And then there were none. Thank you, Miss Burnwood. Now, it's my turn. Stay down. Boss wants you alive. Yeah? How about now? Over here! Cover me! Guys consider drinks? We consider drinks. Walk away. <laughs> or what? You gonna take us all on? Don't. Tell the constant to start running. He could have handled it. You think you've won? 47 is out there, and 47 never misses his mark. Neither do you, Miss Burnwood. That's what makes you valuable. You're delusional. You think I would betray 47? Trust me, you owe him nothing. What is this? I told you we could help each other, and I meant it. Oh, yeah, he didn't reveal it. To your call. I forgot. He didn't reveal that, uh... He hinted at it, but he didn't tell her. Okay. Gray is gone. Go to Berlin and stay out of sight. We're all that's left now. I don't remember who Olivia is. Been a while since two! I did not Sherlock Holmes that mission. I'm so mad about that. We solved the case, but not really. So I still have to do all three of these. I didn't complete any of these. This is the one I really want to do, though. Her final resting place. Alright, so... Tomorrow, we will do Apex Predator. I'll do that tomorrow. Ah! I'm so mad! Alright, uh, well that's it. That's it for tonight. Yeah, sorta of nailed it. I was close to solving the case and I kinda of blew it. Yeah, the third floor is not the place to go to, to solve the case. Probably not. It was somewhere else. I don't... Maybe it was that outside... There was one more place to investigate outside. Maybe that was it? Or maybe it was in the greenhouse but I screwed it up by... I don't know. But that's it for now. I had fun. I hope you have fun watching. That's what's all about, isn't it? Having fun. Thanks for coming by and... See you next time.